Hey guys, it's Cisco Spider. Welcome to a new series on my channel where I pretty much review old cartoons. It doesn't really matter what year these shows came out, as long as they've been cancelled. So shows like Spongebob and Simpsons don't count, but shows like Young Justice and Mr. Incorporated do. So let's start this off with one of the first ever Nicktoons, Rocco's Modern Life. So this show is about a kangaroo named Rocco going through his, well, modern life. What I love about the show is how realistic it is in a cartoony way. There's a lot of relatable things for adults like the annoyance of Garbage Day or what can go wrong on an airplane, um, but there is still a lot of exaggerated cartoony moments for the kids even though a lot of the jokes are for adults and not for kids. And that's another thing I love about the show is how dirty it is. They got away with a ton of adult jokes, which I love. Um, heck, there is an episode of Rockless Bar and Life that got banned because it was way too dirty for kids. It was pretty much about uh, Miss Big Head seducing Rocco in a sexual type way. <laughs> that's not for kids. And the show does a great way of hiding all the dirty jokes. So if you watch this as a kid, you probably didn't even notice all these adult jokes. But when you watch them now, all grown up, you probably notice how not for kids it is. The show does look like your typical talking animal cartoon, but it is way more. I feel like the show is more for teenagers or adults. Although, kids can still get a kick out of it, um, but I feel like, you know, People who actually understand these uh, adult jokes and these adult references would like it a lot more. And have you guys noticed that all the background in the show are not straight? Like, even the buildings have a little curve to it. I don't, I don't know. It just, it was, at first, it looked weird to me. But I guess it does have its own unique style. And it's nothing too awful, I guess. So yeah, this is definitely one of my favorite Nickelodeon shows, and definitely one of my favorite cartoons from the 90s. Um, they have released all 52 episodes, including the band episode on DVD, although some of the scenes like the no-tell motel scenes are gone. But hey, at least they have released every single episode of Rocko's Modern Life on DVD. Can't say the same for any Cartoon Network show besides the Powerpuff Girls and Samurai Jack. Um, so yeah, I would definitely recommend watching the show if it's on DVD or illegally online. I'd still say go ahead, watch it. Um, so yeah, I'm the Disco Spider, and peace out.